What is up everybody? Welcome back to another video and in this video I'm going to be opening opening up some stuff from my P.O. box. Actually, I'm only going to be opening two things from my P.O. box because one of these is for a brand showcase uh, real soon so be on the lookout for that but I'm going to put that aside for now. So realistically, I'm going to be opening up two pieces today. If you guys want to send me a letter or package or whatever you want to send me, my P.O. box will be right here on the screen. You guys can send me whatever. Send me a letter. I mean, you don't really need to send me something crazy. Or if you're a brand, if you want to send me some brand type clothing or stuff to kind of look at and review and kind of process in my mind what to say, um, you can send it there. Just if you're a brand or a company, please email me in advance. Otherwise, I will not review or check out your package. But anyways, let's get straight into it. So starting off with the letter. I love letters because, you know, letters are really heartfelt and it got me all emotional, Drake type emotional. So this letter is from Canada. I, I scratched out their address, but it's from Canada. It has all these stamps on it. Look at that stamp. Look, look there's a little cat on this side. What? Anyways, I'm gonna open up the letter. Alright, so here is the letter. It's a really nice little letter here. Uh, this is written August 7th. Wow, it, it, took, it took a while because today is, I think, August 25th. I, I feel like this is gonna be some heartfelt letter, so let me let me kind of mentally prepare myself for this. So the letter goes, Dear Ken, I'm touring through Montana right now, camping. Headed home to Canada. I saw a notification of your latest come across the spotty Wi-Fi and stood outside the showers just to watch it on a road. I'm sorry in advance if I can't read your cursive. I, I'm gonna try my best, and if I get anything wrong, please correct me. So moving on with the letter, I'm an avid sewer seamstress and have launched my own line, Expatriate. Patriots? Patriots? I don't know if that says Patriots or Patriots. Anyways, I'd love a shout out and or your autograph. Please continue the videos, you inspire me. And then a little, little uh, parentheses, I want a P.O. box, lol. <laughs> Most sincerely, Gia Alexander. I'll put your information right here and thank you Gia for sending this letter. I feel like I should start putting my like, my fan mail on my wall here. I just removed a lot of stuff off my wall just cause I'm trying to figure out how I want to redesign my room. But I think I should put like a, a part of my wall or dedicate a part of my wall for like fan letters or the stuff that gets sent to my P.O. box. So again, check out Stone for Sports on Instagram, on Facebook, check out her stuff. Uh, thank you Gia again for the letter, I'm going to cherish it and uh, yeah, alright, moving on. Alright, so the next package is from Tiffany, I don't think she wants me to say her last name. Uh, it's in this little, uh, little package here. Right here. I don't know if I should be shaking the package. I might be destroying whatever she sent me. Okay, so... I'm gonna read the letter and then I'm gonna show you guys what was sent to me. Okay, I, I gotta prepare myself again because, I don't know, letters always make me feel so, like, caught up. So, let me, let me mentally prepare myself for this one. Alright, so, Ken, I just wanna say hi and say thank you. I really love watching your videos. I don't do much sewing for the guys in my house, mostly because I don't know what to make for them, what to style-wise for guys. You have given me some really great ideas on things I can make for them. Very glad you are able to keep making videos. I was sad when you said you weren't sure how or what was going to work for you. Man, that sounds selfish on my part. I mean, it's all, I honestly, it doesn't really matter. I'm, I want to continue making videos, even if it's, it's like putting me in, in a worse position just because like I feel like I've been helping people. I help people, you know, get to a better place. I don't know. Anyways, going back to the letter, I don't mean it that way though. I would totally miss your stuff, but I know how hard it is to not be able to do what you love to do. It sucks. <laughs> it seriously does suck. 
And so I'm glad you can continue, and I'm glad that I can continue. It's it's such a weird, it's been a weird experience for me this year. It's just I've gone through so much stuff, and I'm still here doing this for you guys. So I'm a, I'm gonna keep going. I'm a, I'm gonna keep doing this. I'm on a somewhat tight budget, so I can I can't help financially help you financially. But I wanted to do something to show you support. I hope these are all things you will use. I was getting myself some stuff while it, while it was on sale, and I thought of you. So hope you can use them. Dang. Okay. On another note, your mom is adorable. I love the videos. I've seen where your mom is with you. I am a mom, and. I would love for either of my kids to include me in on their passion. As a mom, I want to say awesome. <laughs> Keep doing what you love, even when it's hard. You have a true gift, and those of us who share that passion with you are really glad you were there showing us what you know. I just figured out today that I have two YouTube accounts, so I have you on both. Not sure what my name is on one of them. Well, how it's spelled actually. I do watch you on both. When I'm at home, my daughter, who is nine years old, will sit and watch some of your videos with me. I think my son, who is 17 in a week and a half, has sat and watched them with me too. She already tries hand sewing stuff for her dolls, so you are an influence. So you are influencing her as well. Okay, I will let you go now. I just really wanted you to know just how much I appreciate you sharing what you love and teaching me. Thank you. Tiffany, fighting, she writes at the bottom. Honestly, <laughs> oh man. <laughs> uh, honestly, that, honest, honestly, I, I don't know what to say. When I signed up for this P.O. box, I didn't know what I was going to expect, but that was really heartfelt, and... <laughs> I don't know, guys. <laughs> I don't know. I really... <laughs> I don't know what to say. Okay, I put myself together. I had a little moment and I'm going to be putting these letters on my wall just to remind me that I need to keep doing and working hard for what I love and what I do. So I'm just going to put this aside, I'm going to put it on my wall later, I'm going to make a wall of ad mail. But just kind of looking what's inside of this package, oh you didn't need to do this, you don't need it, uh, you, didn't need to, you didn't really need to do this. Oh my gosh, thank you Tiffany, I appreciate it, I really do. So she got me pinking shears, basically what this is, it's if you don't want to, or if you have a raw finish to an edge, use pinking shears or just shear scissors. I've never had a pair, I, I don't know why I don't have a pair at this point, but she definitely got me one. And Let's, let's, let me let me go through all this before I say thank you after every single thing. And then she got me pins, you know what I'm saying, with a bunch of pins. And then the last two things that was in this package is some needles. You guys don't need to send me sewing supplies. I do appreciate this, Tiffany, I really do, and I appreciate the letters. It's just that, I mean, you guys don't have to do that. I'm just blessed already just to be where I am right now and able to kind of talk to you guys, have you guys as an audience, have you as a family. So I just want to say thank you. Um, if you guys want to send me a letter, get it read, get it posted on my wall behind me. Um, be sure to uh, send letters. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm so I'm kind of I'm still. I'm still blown away from the letters and it made me realize so many things right now. So anyways, I'm gonna stop, I'm gonna stop like being all emotional and whatnot, but I'm happy, I'm happy, like it was it was like uh, I don't know what to say, I don't know what to say guys. But I hope you guys enjoy this video. It's a it's a chill one, it's an it's a heartfelt one. Um here's my PO box address again if you want to send me mail, um if you're a brand. Or anything that wants anyone that wants to sponsor me, uh, all this can be sent at this PO box. So 
Thanks for watching this P.O. Box unboxing. Hope you guys enjoyed it. I love you guys. Remember to keep it daily. And I'll catch you guys next time. Pew!